You are my sunshine, my little sunshine. You make me happy when skies are gray. What is that? That's a cute song. Come on. Are you doofus? I'm a kid, you know? You are? Okay. How old do you think I am? Ten. Is that a kid? Yes. Okay, good, genius. <laughs> ball, right? Ball. Not bald, just ball. So, initially, our ball has an x velocity of minus 1. Or let's just write that a little bigger, sorry. Vix is equal to minus 1 meters per second. And Viy is 4 meters per second. Three seconds later, we get this. Vix is now 4 meters per second, so we can call it Vfx, yes. And then Viy is now Vfy, and it is negative 2 meters per second. So, the question is, Find the angle, okay, so let's do it. Find the magnitude and direction, and by direction they mean the angle of the acceleration. All right, so let's do this. So, this is actually pretty easy once you know how to break it down. You have a hunch to try and find the resultants over here, but no, no, that's not what we're doing. Instead, what we want to do is we want to find our acceleration in the x, which is Vfx minus Vix over t. Come on, there's a reason why they gave us this three seconds. And you also want to find a y, which is Vfy minus Viy over t. And then you want to find the total acceleration by square rooting them. So uh, we have ax squared plus ay squared. And now let's try working all of this out. What is ax squared? No, not ax squared, just plain old ax. Well, if we look, vfx is four. So, we can put that over here, and the ix is negative 1, so we can put that over here, and we know that our time is 3 seconds. So negative and negative! Oh my god. Okay, so... I said, negative, negative, positive. Isn't it racist? Okay, so, that means that we get 5 over 3 meters per how second did squared. Get, how did you get negative, negative, positive? Let's just erase this because we've already done this step. And what about a y? Well, we get minus 2. And then uh, for our initial, we have just plain old 4. So we can put that over there. And do not call this racist. Over 3. So that's, and we can erase this now, minus 6 over 3 which is minus 2 meters per second squared. Now, let's do this step. The acceleration is equal to, and let's erase this, the square root of ax squared, which, let's write that down, is 5 over 3 squared. And then we have ay, which is minus 2 squared. He's about to find some way to call this racist, I'm telling you. Okay. So, we get a is the square root of 25 over 9 plus... Plus... Uh, because the square of a negative is a positive. So, negative, negative, positive four. again? Is it legal? So, now we get a is the square root of 61 over 9. And this is equal to about 2.6. <coughs> All right. So now, what are we to do? Well, we also have to find the direction of the acceleration as well. So how do we do that? Well, let's 
visualize. I don't, I can't visualize. So to visualize, let's draw our AX, which is my uh, five thirds. Our AY, which is mm -hmm. minus two meters. Oh, sorry, let's just write that a little better. AY equals minus two meters per second squared. Isaac, is it factor addition? And now we are going to do the parallelogram method. This is our AY and this is our AX. And that means that our resultant will be over here. And we want to know... That's 2.6, right? Uh, yeah, I guess the uh, acceleration resultant is 2.6 meters per second. And now, what we want to know is the angle, obviously, with respect to the horizontal. So this data. And what is that? Why are you sniffing like that? All right. Wait, fudge. Did I forget the angle? The angle has to Oh, no, 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 I get it. Okay, so what is the answer here? Well, the answer here has to be, well, this is kind of convenient because we already have AX and AY. So that means that theta is just going to be arctan of opposite over adjacent. Mm -hmm. What is opposite? Uh, well, it's AY. So let's write that down. Adjacent, AX. So let's write that down. So we have theta is equal to arctan of negative 6 over 5, 50 degrees. That is it. And let's actually write that bigger so you all can see. Negative 50.2 degrees. And the, acce the acceleration is 2.6 meters per second squared. That's it. Thank you everybody for watching. Saborno Isaac Bari, who is known as the god of mathematics, became the youngest professor in the history of mankind.